Hello there, welcome to the third devlog. For those who are new, Luggage is an arcade driving physics game where you need to go through a track full of obstacles while trying to keep your goods. This update video is dedicated to level design. Level design is one of the most challenging aspects of this project, and I tried different approaches. The first one was to study Trackmania. The tracks are really well built and they suit the game. However, Trackmania is a racing game, Luggage is not so that kind of level design is not going to work. Then I watched some Fall Guys gameplay, and that seemed more like my vision actually. I love the fun and chaotic levels. But since cars can jump on luggage, I need to come up with a formula of my own. One thing is certain, the tracks must be fun to navigate. That is one of the basic principles for level design. And also, I want to reward skilled players. For example, you can choose a slow but easy path, or drive through a hard section but reach the main road faster. So I opened Blender. And I actually had 3D modeling classes in college a long time ago, uh, but I never got really deep into it, I don't know why. So despite taking a long time, I'm enjoying this process of creating my own assets. I'm certain that this won't be the final art though, but it sure works for prototyping. I made a crane and some steel beams, as well as a bunch of cliffs so I could uh, reuse them. Some objects modeled, I began working on the level layout and then adding environment assets. Here's a little time lapse. And after some level design, this is the end result. There's a huge difference between the grey boxing stage and the actual level with some models. Then I noticed that the car was missing something, and I had to take a break from level design as well. So I worked on a smoke particle effect and some skid marks for when you're drifting. And also a friend of mine suggested adding particles for when the items uh, drop to the floor. So, in conclusion, I still feel like I haven't found the game's identity yet. I'm struggling a bit to find a coherent art style and personality, mainly due to my inexperience in modeling, but I think that's fine and totally expected. Uh, things will get better, I hope. Building levels consumes a lot of time, and I was discussing this with a fellow game dev friend. After a brief talk, he suggested something that will change entirely this game's concept. I won't spoil it now, but if you are curious, you can follow me to get updates more frequently. Let's just say that if I go forth with this, big changes are coming. That's all for this vlog. I hope you enjoyed. If you feel like supporting me, I have the links to my pages below. Thank you very much for watching, that's all. Peace.